please explain to me how the liquid cooling works. Well, first up, we've got our CPU block, which keeps your CPU really cool while running intensive tasks. It performs a lot better than a standard air cooler, and it keeps it cooler, lasts longer, and higher performance. Okay, and what is this? This is the GPU water block, which will keep your graphics card much cooler during the like, gaming or something like that. It's also much quieter than the stock graphics card cooler. Mm -hmm. And what this here? This is the motherboard block. While these aren't necessarily required, they make it look really cool. Okay, and all these pipes, they go here. This is the reservoir. Yep, this is actually a reservoir pump combination. This is great for beginners to start because they don't have to worry about loop board or anything. It's all right there, ready to go. Okay, and how does it actually work? Where does the water go? So the water starts in the reservoir and it goes down into the pump. And the pump pumps the water through the water blocks. The water blocks have channels which will then absorb the heat from the components and then the water cools the channels and absorbs that heat. Mm -hmm. And as the water absorbs the heat, then it goes into the radiator which absorbs the heat from the water mm -hmm. and then the fans cool the radiator. Wow. And what about all these uh, cute accessories? I mean, for me, these are accessories, but for you, obviously not. <laughs> these are called fittings. Uh, they have tons of sizes, but all you need to know is the inner diameter and the outer diameter of your tubing, so you can choose your fittings. Okay. The, our particular fittings you come in nickel, black nickel, black, red, blue, yellow, and white. Wow, so you can pimp your computer. Yeah, you can do whatever you want. In this particular one, we haven't had clear coolant, but we can combine red and white coolant to get pink and to match your shirt. Wow, so you thought also about women. Yes. <laughs> but you, I can see if you put pink color inside, I can see it here. What about the pipes? I can't see the flow. Well, in this particular build, we're using our black rubber base tubing, but we do have plastic clear base tubing, which you can see all the coolant in. We also have clear blocks available, so you can see the coolant in there. And when you put it all together, it looks really cool. Yeah, it does, I imagine. And is it simple to put together by yourself or you have to call somebody? Uh, it's actually surprisingly simple. Although it looks complex here, it's very straightforward process. There are tons of guides on the internet as well as our own YouTube channel. EK also publishes many guides on how to install their kits, included in all of their kits if you buy from them or you can go to their website to download the manuals that have very thorough step-by-step -step guides that will help you solve any problems you may have. Okay, will you teach me how to do it? Of course. When do you want to start? Now, let's go. Okay.